Hey guys, Dirt and Rust here. Just got back from the flea market. Let me show you what I picked up. Got this Framer 25 made by Hart for two bucks. Milk face. Uh, this was three three bucks I think and it is I believe it's a craftsman yeah three bucks on that and this one is a Avon a ball peen hammer two bucks uh, this is a cool one it's a, a Williams I don't find too many Williams hammers this one's a number 2-0 Ball peen hammer. And two bucks. This was a, a buck. And it's got the Craftsman circle or oval logo. Logo. Um, I think that's a bit older. I'm going to have to research that. Pretty cool for a buck. <clears throat> this is kind of a mystery tool for me. I picked it up for a buck. I didn't know what it was. I took a quick glance on Google and found out it's uh, some sort of boring rod. Um, but that's about all I know. I'm not quite sure how they're used. Maybe a blade goes in through here of some sort. I don't know. Uh, let me know if any of you guys know about these uh, boring rods. Armstrong 83-507, 15 sixteenths for a buck. Another one for a buck. This is a... Uh, um, a socket Let's see it's yeah bog manufacturing co chicago offset socket uh this was a throw in a little uh plum combo wrench one Two two zero. Little Sears open end here. Uh, it was just in the bottom of my backpack. I'd forgotten about it. Um, picked up this case uh, trapper for five bucks. I haven't looked real close to see what the date codes are on it or anything um, looks like 3207 CV there Oops. so yeah case can't see the stampings too well uh, on this yeah but I will research that later probably do a short video of it clean it up it's got some got some residue and junk in there I need to clean off but for five bucks pretty good condition um, these were just grungy 
pocket knives I got for a buck each. Um, I think this one's a Frost uh, SAR. It's like a Frost Cutlery. Yeah, let's see here. Yeah. And this one too. Another, another Frost. Uh, this was a freebie. A Let's 81, I don't know. And then this was a buck. Hey, why not pick it up for a buck? Um, I think it's, let's see, made in Korea. No, there's maker's marks. And it says what, black? Black something, shepherd, I don't know. Hard to read that. Yep, that was my tool haul. It was a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye.